Here I have a U-Haul transmission cooler installed in a 2000 Subaru Legacy. Uh, this belongs to a guy who I am him, his regular Subaru mechanic. The last service I've done on this car was to change the transmission fluid and change the front and rear differential. Uh, for the purpose of towing a small pop-up camper and he asked me to install this transmission cooler here. Here it is mounted to the front of the uh, condenser for the air conditioner and I have these little push through style zip ties that I have installed behind and through which I've moved the radiator out of the way for. I could have just punched the thing all the way through the radiator and out the other side but I wanted to maintain the ability to remove the radiator for service such as timing belts, water pumps, coolant flushes, etc. Um, this guy ties in directly to the transmission cooler line. And there where you see that yellow wax, that's where I had uh, used the uh, T-Tech machine to perform the transmission flush. Uh, that line there comes out of the transmission and into the bottom of the radiator. And then the return line is intercepted by the transmission cooler. And that line runs along uh, through the side here, out the side, and into the right side. And the fluid come in off the car, goes into the radiator, and then out the return side, through the trans cooler on this side, and then across the trans cooler, and then returns into the return loop on the body of the car. And this is our U-Haul transmission cooler.